In this video, we will be featuring the Jensen Global Cyanoacrylate Adhesive Dispensing Systems. The first system is the digital version, and the second is a purely pneumatic option. These systems are specifically designed to dispense adhesives from a self-contained pressurized tank, which prevents premature curing and reduces the operator's exposure to harmful fumes. Included in the digital system is a digital touchscreen dispenser a diaphragm valve with a stand a one pound pressure tank and tubing. The valve requires a minimum of 70 PSI to actuate the material flow. The stroke adjustment knob allows you to increase or decrease the material flow rate. For thick materials like cyanoacrylate gels, you may need to increase the stroke to get the proper flow. For thinner materials, you want to decrease the stroke to reduce the flow. To set up the system, remove the lid and place the bottle of CA into the tank. Measure the 532nd material line to the height of the tank and insert through the material port into the bottle and ensure the line reaches the bottom. Fasten the three-wing nut on the lid and tighten the brass material fitting to ensure no air leaks. Connect the material line to the fitting located here on the fluid housing. The port labeled air out on the dispenser is where the clear 532nd inch air line attaches to the valve. Connect the air source to the regulator on the back side of the dispenser. This gauge controls the material pressure in the tank. There is a second gauge that is located on the front of the dispenser that controls the actuation of the valve. Connect the quarter inch air line from the regulator to the air in port on the tank. The regulator and gauge on the front of the dispenser should stay at 70 PSI and the regulator on the back side should be at 0 PSI. The flow of material is determined by stroke adjust, dispensing tip, and the pressure of the tank. Set the dispenser to manual mode and with no pressure set to the tank. Press the foot pedal to activate the valve. You should hear and feel the valve opening and closing. Also. Make sure the stroke adjust is set to about a quarter turn to the right from the closed position, which is a good starting point to test your material. Pressurize the tank slowly by adjusting the regulator and let the material flow through the line and reach the valve. To test material flow, start at 5 PSI and adjust the pressure as needed. Press the foot pedal and test your flow. To adjust the flow of material, Rotate the adjustment knob slightly to the left to open up the valve. Do this until you reach your desired flow rate. Now your system is set up, tested, and is ready to start dispensing. Our manual diaphragm valve is a hand-operated dispensing valve and purely pneumatic. It is used in conjunction with a one-pound tank and is actuated by pressing the lever on the valve. Ideal for applications that do not have access to electricity but need a way to dispense a material that is required to be pressurized in a tank. Connect the material line to the material port of the valve. Then, take the other end and feed the material line through the material port at the top of the tank. It is recommended to insert the tube prior to securing the lid of the tank so that the operator may visually confirm that the material line has been properly inserted into the bottle. Unscrew the wing nuts and place the material in the tank. Ensure that the material line reaches the bottom of the bottle. Place the tank lid back on and make sure that all the wing nuts and brass material ports are secure to ensure proper pressurization. Using your quarter inch clear air line, press fit the tubing into the bottom of the tank and to the external regulator and gauge. Then connect to your dry air source. Adjust the regulator to a minimum pressure of 10 PSI to begin pressurization. Now once pressurized, the material will take a few seconds to travel to the valve and enable the operator to test the flow of material. Increasing or decreasing the regulator will allow the operator to control the flow of material. You're now ready to start dispensing.